Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Import Tuner Challenge. I know a couple of you have been waiting for this. Decided to get on the 360 today and uh, boot it up. I just did a, free, a little bit of a free run, just a few seconds, just to get the controls down again, because it is permadeath, so, you know, I don't want to be, you know, losing instantly. But let's see. Let, let's see how we get on. Let's continue. And we have the V35. We should be okay. We've got a couple upgrades for it. Yeah, we've got 29,000 uh, credits, so we're not doing particularly well money-wise. But we did just we did just spend it, so we got some we got some nice rear fenders, some lip kits. You know, nothing crazy. I don't want to stray too far from the original um, look, but overall, I I think I want to also. I mean, I don't know. I want to personalize it a little bit, but while keeping that same emperor look to it. If you know what I mean? Because the likelihood is, if I if if the the emperor probably would mod. I mean, hello. At the end of the game, he uh, he has a, uh, uh, a Subaru anyway, so an STI, so you know. But I thought, you know, let me just um, let me modify it a little bit because he wouldn't keep it the same for the entire game anyway, I doubt. But anyway, let's just uh, let's course in now. I am gonna have to get a, get a guide up if we get if we get far enough to do proper wanderers. Uh, well, wanderers in general. I'm gonna have to. Um, I'm gonna have to get up a guide because there are many of them. And some of them are hard to get. Some of them actually probably will re would require me actually preparing, not off camera, but I would have to just um, cut out a good bit. So let's see if there's anyone in the here. Okay, right. Lonely Wolf. I don't think I can. I don't have that experience. Yeah. Okay. Fantastic Phoenix, changing stage team leader. You're the one, aren't you? You're the street racer that's been tormenting my writers and editors, right? I'm just not a big enough sucker to take that kind of treatment lying down. I'm taking you out for the honor of my magazine and my team, and I'll write it up. In, I'll write it up big in next month's issue. Fantastic Phoenix runs riot on the sea on C1 Loop. Come on, son. It's, a, it's an SP battle, so it's either. Mm, I mean, I think we. I think we'll have a bit more grunt. The only issue is in a, in a time in a time attack, you can't die by you can't lose by crashing to the walls, and sometimes you do sort of bang into walls a bit. But we'll see how we go. SP battles can sometimes be in our favour. Get over quickly, right. This is a good start. We've got a corner up here, which is quite... Um... Oh, yeah, look. he's. Hold on. I'm going to knot it up here because this first corner is everything. They are very slow. In corners, they're kind of slow in corners, yeah, well, but around the first corner, they're particularly slow. So, there we go. Let's... There we go. We can just take our time here. Let's keep our SP intact. There we go. See how slow he is? We're already building a lead crash. Right, it's going to take a couple of minutes, I imagine. Let's knot it a bit. I'll keep a tiny bit left in reserves. You never know. Okay. I quite like Hogwarts View on this game. I don't know why. I know they, they take away the wheel, but I don't know. They kind of have to at this position. It would be a bit cumbersome otherwise, but I like it. I don't know. It feels nice to drive. Okay. We're about to win. Let's knot it. Actually, uh, we're going to go back to PA anyway, so we'll have full moss. There we go. 200 grand. Not much in the game, but... The nice thing is you get a win multiplier, so... If you, um... If you win a lot, you'll get yourselves a, um... Like, if you keep winning in one day, you'll get a lot of, um... <laughs> you get a lot of money. Uh, I, I, no way. I lost. You're pretty good. Give me a scoop sometime. I'll do a 10-page cover feature on the shooting star of the C1 loop. Pretty good, would you say? One thing, though. The fact that you beat me stays off the record. I'm going to come up with my, with my own magazine. Uh, what, would, what, would, what would I call my magazine if I was, if I was driving the C1 loop? If I, if, okay, I... Hmm. Uh, I don't know. Fuck it, Ring Magazine. It's real. Like, it, it, like, let's just say Japan doesn't really have Ring Magazine at this point, um, because literally we're driving around a ring. Eh, it's a play on a weapon thing. Anyway, who we got now? Okay, just this guy who we can't face yet. I don't exactly. I forget how we get him to come out of. Our, can't come at us. Right, let's check this. Got a carbon chassis and a rear engine. Hold on, he wants to do that with an 8.6. Yeah, that would not be the same car anymore. The whole point of an A6 is the, the underdog story of it, kind of. I suppose to get Drifting Striker's notes, but he's not here. What do I do? I'll be left back for sure. Did he say left back? Yeah. 
taking chances. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> right, well, let's just back out of here, because there might be a, You know what? For the sake of it, I have to just get rid of these. Uh -huh. Oh, they can race in both directions. Sweet. Give me the exclusive when you get famous. Okay. Let's go out. Now, if there are some... Uh, some drivers out here that we haven't beaten, that means we have our chance. We have a good chance of getting some... Uh, building that combo multiplier up. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's uh, Bloodhound. First boss. Technically, the Wanderers are only needed to actually beat the, um, get, beat the secret boss. Okay. Right, is he going to storm away at a million miles an hour? Hmm, surprisingly not. I am nosing it, but, hold on. Let's just, right. There you go. I'll, yeah, he, he can slot in behind. Absolutely noss the fuck out of this turn there. Uh, we got a nice advantage on him now. What's the look back button? I forgot. It's not X, is it? Uh, I don't know, actually. I've forgotten. Can you physically look back? Do I want it? Nope, that's handbrake. Okay. Okay, alright, you just flip. Okay, you click. You can't do it here, but you just click the stick in regular views. Okay. Alright, he's almost done. He's quite a long way behind now. Man, this car handles really nicely, despite being really heavy. It turns in... It has got a little bit of oversteer, but... Or instability, rather, but it's okay. It's not too bad. Oh, dear. Okay, there we go. We got 990k for that. Yeah. Oh, and another bonus. Another million. Cutscene time. Oh, no, no, no. End of the day. You've clearly shown me what you can do. I admit. I didn't recognise you. I can hardly believe that you're the same loser that challenged me before. I guess my perceptions aren't all that reliable after all. Racing you put me in the mind of King Speed, the legendary street racer who used to be the fastest driver on the Metro. I wonder what he's doing these days. It's been three years since he quit street racing, and the Metro is a whole different place now. You might have been able to bring out your full potential, but there's no point in wishing about that about, about what might have been. You'll have to find your own way to the top. When I face him, I'm going to strip all the parts off this car, um, visually, and just race king speed with the deep with the you know the stock looking um v35 just because you know if, if it would make sense say have you been to Shib uh, shibuya route 3 yet i did say that right um i always used to get that confused uh what what you need now is experience showing your face over there wouldn't be so but wouldn't be a bad idea nice straight lines we got we got top end speed I must say though, uh, just when you start on that route, that like there's a, when you get to the end of the highway, um, if you challenge an AR there, they 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 are hilariously slow through the toll booth gates. Okay, so it's 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 a good chance to get ahead, especially if you're fighting a, an end game boss or somewhere near the end game. Rating rather, muffle level three has become available. Clutch level three, sweet stickers, bloodhound, custom cars. Custom cars are cool, but they're not really worth it because you can't upgrade them. Okay. Tuning shop. Right. Shall we pop on some things? What about me? Yeah, let's go muffler level 3. Uh, level 2. Fucking hell. That gives us a 10 horsepower. PS. Um, it also lightens our car. Give a, gives, a, gives us a bit more torque. Hmm. Maybe there's a better investment to make here. 
It's 300 grand. Is it worth it? Oh, let's go. What about engine level 3? Fucking hell. That's definitely worth it. That's We can afford that. Just, but it's worth it. Level, end, uh, level engine 3. Uh, level, uh, yeah, engine level 3. That's too much, yeah. Nitro system. Yeah, can't get any higher. Um... Uh, hmm. We've only got 200 grand left. I don't think there's much else we can do here. Yeah. Maybe I should save it for, um... I don't know, anything we can do aero-wise? Wait, these are... these are. Hold on a minute. Yeah, I just realized. These are never locked, anyway. I think we decided we, we uh... We decided just... Yeah, we decided to keep it relatively spoiler-free. In fact, completely spoiler free. Nothing on this. N like none of these really. Oh yeah, we got them here. It's nothing. Uh, just some small modifications. I know nothing on here. I like particularly much for this car. But hey, oh actually, we actually have no furnace. At oh wait, I think it might be. Is, does this car just come with a? I guess, I guess this car just comes with uh, the furnace at the rear then. Fair enough. All right, well, there's no point in putting a neon on, I don't think. Sticker, maybe? Let's see, is there, is there a decent place to put a sticker? Let's see, maybe on the right side here. Uh, teams, this is, I believe Team Logos is how you get, um... Team Logos is how you get a higher MAD name. BAD name, rather. Hold on, let's... This game had a pretty good livery editor, honestly, for the time. You know what? I uh, it's cool, but I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna. No, I don't bother. I'm not gonna bother with that. Let's just remove stick. Remove. Yes, I really want to stick. Remove. Right. We'll just leave that. We'll just head uh, head out. Actually, no. Wait. Hold on. Okay, we go at level two tires. I guess I'll spend a bit of money then on. Uh... Ooh, should I get a new clutch? I may get a new clutch. Hold on, can I even? Hold on, wait. Yeah, I could. I, I can buy a new clutch. I've got the money for it. Brakes are okay. LSD. We got a two. Yeah, we got a two way. Okay. Um, I'll buy a clutch. Why not? Faster gear shifts are always nice. Okay, and we've got a new engine, so. Okay, course in. Let's check out this new area, shall we? Actually, have we got Daybreak yet? Yeah, I don't know. Let's start out Daybreak. Uh, let's go to the BA. And we shall find out who we have lying in the, uh, in the shadows. Okay, anyone got some information? Self-described racer kid. Oh, well, I do know how to configure them. But thank you. Okay. So she's basically telling me to slam it. Is she? Is she, is she by any chance related to, uh, or does she work for Ghost Games? <laughs> oh boy. Okay, this is going to be trouble. This is going to be. These guys are quick. I mean, they've got 350Zs and a JZA, a JZA70. So yeah, this is going to be tricky. Also, notice how their wheels are actually um, spinning. It's a weird glitch, but I never really noticed it until a few... I think the last episode. Okay, well, let's just take on one of these guys. It's an SV battle. This may be the end. This may be the end right here. Like, I don't know how much power they have. Oh, I could check, actually. I think you can check. My only hope is that they're ridiculously slow coming out of the toll gates up here. Okay. Oh, uh, no, we're doing okay. I thought they were slow. Okay, well, they have a chance of crashing. But I remember them being slow at some point. Maybe it's a different point. Either way, we're doing okay. Oh, yeah, we're good. See ya. Holy shit. Okay, they have no top-end speed. It's all. I guess they're all about acceleration. Not wise when you're on a, a really straight line. Hey, I'll take it. Why not loss it? About to max out. How, how fast can this thing go? 
175. 176. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. 176. And the great thing is, that's like, that's just, there's like, a really nice balance between having a lot of top end speed and having decent acceleration. So that was with the NOS and everything on a straight line. We didn't run out of, uh, and Slipstream, we didn't run out of uh, revs. So that's good. Let's face this, mate, shall we? Let's face the Supra. Yes, face me. Mr. Ace Hall. Oh, I guess I can't check out that car. Shame. I thought I could. Maybe that's in course data. Okay. Right. How quick is this going to be? I've got an itch. Now I've got an itch. I've got an itch. There we go. Amazing blue. Oh boy. Didn't change gear. That's quicker. That's definitely quicker. But it's okay, let's not panic. We've got slipstream. Oh yeah, let's see. We're catching up now. Oh, I see you. Are you okay? Man's using some strats. Oi! Oi, you cut! Come here, you bastard. Yeah. Try blocking me off now, cunt. What a piece of shit. Well, I suppose... I do it to some enemies. Enemies. I do it to some AI. So, fair enough. Well, we're good. We are absolutely taking off. This game looks really good for something that came out like, from 2006, around the Xbox 360's launch. Shame they ran out of budget, uh, money, man. Money and time. Otherwise, this could have been incredible. It already is really good, but... Had there been a bit more... Um, a bit more content, maybe some more routes... Man, this would have been so good. More cars as well. Like, there is a lot of, like, racing, uh, races to race, but... Yeah, it's just a... It is a shame that there isn't, that there isn't just a bit more. But, you know... It's all good. Okay, so I can't see. Okay, well... This... We, this will be a longer race, obviously. It's a, it's a, there's no SP in this, so it's just um, a straight dash to the finish. Point to point. Which is a good thing if his car is ridiculously quick. Then again, if it's ridiculously quick, I don't think I can catch up. Unless I just abuse slipstream. The nice thing is I've been able to, I've been able to keep up mostly um, off the get off the line, and here a lot on my head. So unless he's configured his car completely for top end speed, which I can't imagine he has because his uh, his teammates haven't done that. Okay, I don't even know. To, I don't even know if I need to NOS it. I'm, I'm going to anyway, because why not, right? Let's see how much we can. Let's see if we can really max this out. 178. Oh, 178. We're almost at 180. We're not far off. We're basically on the rev limit, so well, I think 180 is a decent guess. Maybe 189 or 179 rather. We're not doing too badly at all. Right, just two miles to go. Comfortably in first. Oh yeah, he's miles. Look at him, he's miles behind. Oh my god, we almost hit 180. Oh, almost. Oh boy! Okay, this car absolutely loses all sense of stability at high speed. Holy shit. Okay, that's the rev limit. So we still have a tiny bit of... Tiny bit of uh, revs to play with. Jesus. Well, I mean, it works because at low speed it, it has a bit more stability. Right. 1.1 multiply. Don't know if anyone else is going to show up in there. Otherwise, I'll just leave and raise some others. No way! I lost! I just can't believe it. Sorry, bud. 
Okay. <clears throat> Let's go out. We have a bunch of enemies to... I keep calling them enemies. A bunch of guys to race up out here. So... Yeah, I see. Right. 180SX. Come on, buddy. Barn. What's their actual name? Bird? I don't know. Holy shit, a 180SX has more acceleration than that guy's 350Z. That's embarrassing. Embarrassing. Well. We'll be okay here. We are... I'm going to save my NOS. There's no, point, there's no point using it when we're out here when we can't just refill instantly. So I'm only going to use it in when I really need to. His SP bar is draining very quickly. And... Bob's your uncle. Okay, an RX aim. So that's like intelligent dream child. No, indulgent dream child, okay. And... Uh-oh. Uh The AI is very good in a straight line. Otherwise, they struggle. But that's why sometimes you have to be strategic in where you pick your fights. Pick your battles, rather. Same thing. Oh, boy. You get past that, Yaris. Called a Vitz in Japan and the US. There we go. On to the next one. Well, we've got ourselves a 350. Ah, the family. Family. Uh, these guys are uh, tricky. He's got some grunt. He really does have some grunt. Oh dear. Bad idea. Might be a bit of a lost time up here. Catching up. Slowly, but surely. Oh, bugger. There we go. Shift down and we got ourselves some nice bit of speed to get past him. We've also got the nice in our back pocket. So it's always good to keep them. The closer counters. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. Not good. There is at least a big corner up there which will give me lots of... Um, if we get there, I think we will. It'll give me lots of... Uh, well, it'll give me a lot of distance, because they are rather slow around tight corners. <laughs> his, his SP is, like, hardly going down. There we go. Really... We're making a gap there. Oh! Oh yeah, his, this is a tag team. I swear if that resets the other guy. It, it's going to, isn't it? Yes, it is. Just piss off. I'll use half my NOS tank. That's an FD. That's going to be scary. Right. Let's hope they crash. There you go. Fifth gear is pretty useful. Yeah, sixth is nice, but it's kind of long, so it doesn't really fit on the C1. Although sometimes we do need it. There you go. Slow down a little bit. Oh, okay, we didn't lose too much speed there. 
Right, we're about to take the win here. And I believe we get double money. We get money that we get. We get two times the money because it's two of them. So, okay. Do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go in reverse and get the other guy, the FD. Back in a sec. Twister. Okay. And I accidentally smash into the back of him. Thankfully, I don't have to pay damages. How quick is he gonna? Okay, that's scary. That's that's scary. Holy shit! Come back. I've got mail. You've got mail. I'm the messenger. Okay, nice corner. Most dangerous thing in the universe. Oh fuck. Speaking of which, just run against the walls. And wall riding in this game is a death sentence. Did I bash him? No, I didn't. It didn't work. I thought I could try and bash him into the uh, intersection bit there. Doing okay. The F uh, the the SP isn't going down super quick yet, but we should be able to gap a bit more around these twists and turns. Once you get ahead, it is. A lot easier. The catching up bit can be tricky. Especially if they're very quick in the straights. Because even though they're, they're slow in the corners, they will blast past you on the straight. But right now, we're looking good. We're looking calm and in control. There's the micro of death. I would love to see Polyphonic give this type of deck game a go. I know it's Genki's speciality, but they don't seem to be doing much these days, unfortunately. Besides Shotoko Battle Mobile, which was... Well, didn't last very long. Family 2. Okay, this means after I beat this guy, Family 1's going to come and pop up. Okay, wow. Well, I guess my... His... his uh, my second gear was a lot longer than his. Do a bit of work here. The slipstream of how I love you. You cheeky bastard. If you want to go toe to toe, we can do that. It will not end well for you, my friend. Trust me on that. It's a pink Sylvia. Unfortunately, can't battle him yet. Be funny if you could like bring like non-related teams into the into the fray. That would kind of make it chaotic, though, and potentially would make it a bit too easy. Because if you could just collect every single one, um, if you just dragged all of the teams along until you had everyone, it would probably lag the game to an insane degree, and it would make like the the game trivially easy uh, to complete. Okay. Right, let's get the uh, car back here. Here we go. Boom, okay. Oh, wait, no, okay. Number two will give you number one when you've beaten the others. Okay, yeah. Boom tribe, okay. And apparently that S15 is quicker than it should be. To be honest, you could probably get some nice power out of that engine. We are starting to get up there. Well, I say up there. We're starting to, yeah, we're past the opening stage, so to speak. So they're going to get a lot more difficult. Well, not a lot more, but they're definitely going to get more difficult in a straight line. Spit, holy shit, though. Seriously, chill. I don't have to use my NOS on an S15. That's well, it doesn't matter what color it is, but don't you dare, don't you dare, don't you dare, you cunt, you shitting. Okay, thanks, dude. Thanks. I'll be sure to uh, never give you a free drink ever again. Oh shit! This might be it. Ah! Ah! No! 
it's over. Oh, I didn't realise. I didn't realise until it started beeping. Well, that's it. That is the end of the permadeath run. We got to at least the next uh, course, I guess. Man. Shame. Hold on. Well, I shall delete this save. Burning Sergeant. That's a shame. That is a shame. Oh well. Oh, we just unlocked some stuff as well. I'll save it, but I'm about to delete. Actually, it doesn't matter. I'll just save it because whatever. Um, when I create a new game, it will get deleted anyway. So, do you know what? Actually, I'm gonna check this again. I'll I'll tell you how many miles we've done. Let's see. Right, we have done 95 miles in this. Uh, uh, V35, this skyline. Managed to get 358 PS out of it. We got some... We, I mean, we, we, we got some decent power out of it. I mean, we, we, we were pretty fast. Okay, yeah, total mileage is 95. Uh, 95 miles, we, hour and 44 minutes. We won almost 7 million credits. We won 31 races and lost one. So, that is a shame. But hey... That's it. I think next time I won't do a permadeath. Next time I'll do a legitimate playthrough. Just you know, just to see how uh, what it could be like. I'll say what it could be like. Just, just to see how we get on. Max speed at one one seven nine point six five. We almost got one hundred eight miles an hour. Shame. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know what you thought. And uh, yeah, I will see you all in the next one. Have a good day, and take care.